Hello, people. How are you all doing today? I want to roll this dice and see who this reading's for. Who is it for? Let me guess. Taurus is going to pop out. <laughs> no. Oh, it's for you, Aquarius. I'm an Aquarius. If this is your first time viewing my channel, Aquarius, please hit subscribe. It's greatly appreciated. I need my channel to grow because I know I should have been around more than I, had, than I am because I have a good energy about me. And I've always been told that. And for you recent subscribers, thank you. I love you. And as soon as I get enough, I'm going to start doing a drawing. And y'all have to give me your email and stuff, okay? So I can figure out who to send it to. Oh, and ooh, this is electric. You have a creative expression about you at the moment. You're getting uh, zaps of spiritual scent throughout your body at the moment and it's it's letting you be creative because you know you're a chosen one yeah i know i am and i know you of course is up there some of you are and uh i love y'all and it's 111 and you know we're on a fast track to ascension yeah we're ascending and growing every day and we uh i got a download last night and I keep going back to my old residence in Virginia. I don't live in Virginia anymore. But I keep going back there. And um, all I know is uh, what woke me up, I felt something pulling on my <laughs> fat row, I'll call it, okay? I felt someone pulling on that. And when I woke up, but it was my stepson trying to warn me something uh, because I know that he's haunting these people because they stole her house that was paid for and I have a deed for it and it got, so it got sold because they didn't pay the taxes and they didn't even pay me rent. So they're the laziest piece of bomb I've ever seen in my world. But that's all right because God will deal with you. Uh, that's who y'all believe in. He's going to deal with you right here on earth. Don't worry, somebody will. But, you know, Divine Last One, he is, he's our king, and he loves us. And uh, I, I still don't know what that download was about, but I, I think tonight I'll figure it out, the rest of it, and then I'll let y'all know about it tomorrow, okay? Okay, of course. But, oh, it's saying it's time to forgive and heal this abandonment. You've been feeling abandoned, and, you know, because you're in separation. <laughs> Excuse me. You're in separation from your divine masculine. Excuse me. My allergies is bad. I've been outside doing a lot of weed eating today and dusting in this old dusty ass room in here. My boys and stuff. But yeah, you need to heal those abandonment issues and forgive and move on so you can be with your divine masculine Aquarius. Because you're going through a total transformation. You know, and it was head versus heart. Maybe you already had someone and your heart was telling you to go to Divine Masculine. And it's saying that you need to forgive and go on with your heart. That's what it's saying. Okay. Divine Masculine loves you. Divine Feminine. Oh, Holy Grill Code. Ooh. If you're like me, this, is, this really is in sync with me because we received this gift. Me and my masculine did. Back in Bible times, back in the book of uh, Joshua, that's where I've linked up my my lineage. It is, and it's amazing. And you know, uh, in the Bible, Joshua was the one who who packed all this stuff. Remember, the Holy Grail. Uh, what is it called? That box. You know, I can't think of it right now. Excuse me, y'all. I'm having a brain fart. Uh, but, you know, this is your true love. This is sent from God. You know, you're, you're, everything is possible, it's telling you, with your divine masculine. Uh, but these divine masculines, they're scared to talk. That's the problem, you know. But he's going through a violet flame activation. Yeah, wrap yourself in that violet flame. Imagine it. Imagine that flame all over you. And I do that daily. Don't worry, divine masculine. I do it every day for us both, okay? But you need to do it too. But it's saying, you know, 
this creative expression that you're doing every day is electric. You chosen ones are on a fast track to ascension. You're going, coming towards your divine masculine, and it's time to forgive. It's time to forgive them of past deeds and transform into this stop doing things from your head and do it in the heart because you're receiving a the, the gift, you know, the gift of your twin flame. Everything is possible. You're all going through violent flame activation at the moment. And 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 what and you need to get rid of this karmic relationship, okay? Release that down past because it's probably done a lot to you, okay? And it's saying you got a pathway to true love, you know, that's your gift. Okay, is this twin flame? And you need to acknowledge and take responsibility for it, you know. Because you went through a rebirth and your personal freedom got unleashed, all right? Oh, thank you for that spirit. I like that little message, don't you all? So, yeah. Bloom, bloom, bloom. Get rid of this past so you can have this. And then, I mean, what more can you want, Aquarius? What is something Aquarius needs to know today, Spirit? Please and thank you. You need to know that. Oh, they're shocked of the new you, Aquarius. This creative genius inside you there. They are really totally shocked about it. That's what that's what's going on right now. And you you know, it's telling you keep faith. Keep faith in this process on your ascension. And and just just keep faith in it, honey. Because um, during a lunar eclipse, you're going. This is going to change. You and your divine masculine is going to get together, and every journey starts with a single step. Look, you're moving towards. You see your suitcase. I told you, I told you. So you need to look up when a lunar eclipse is, because that's when you're all going to come as one, and the word wants to be written. So, it's time to forgive, it says, because the word wants to be written. All right. Battle of the head versus heart. You're receiving. Look here. You're going to receive love. See that? You're receiving downloads, and you're receiving you're receiving heart activation. So, you go towards your love. And what about gift? What about receiving the gift? Oh, this is about collaborative dreaming. Maybe, oh, Maybe you're going to do this in a partnership. I think you and your divine masculine needs to do a business together. What else? Oh, and what do you feel? What do you feel at the moment right now, Aquarius? That's what's being asked of you. What's going on and how, how are you feeling? Remember, everything is possible with your twin flame, Aquarius. Because you're a sacred fool. Yeah, Aquarius and Aries, divine masculine energy. You all take a leap of faith into each other. Violet flame activation. You know, you're having visions of life beyond death. Oh, that's what you're dreaming about at night, ain't it? Yep. Maybe they are. And what about releasing the past? Chiron healing, karma. You need to get rid of that or you're going to receive a lot of karma. 838. So, you know, heal from that past. Release this past and heal from it, honey. Honey or sir. And you need to restore and replenish. Go inside and do the healing and get rid of that. Take me home. Pathway to true love. Pathway to true love says, oh, here's you some Aries energy. Mars, it's coming with force, this love. And Pandora's gift. Oh, look there. You got Pandora's gift. You, This is gifted to you from divine, honey. And you need to take responsibility and acknowledge this. And you need to defend to the end the worthwhile, what you feel is worthy. You need to defend that and take responsibility for it. And... You're reinventing yourself at the moment during Mercury Retrograde. Woo, we are. And please hit subscribe if you feel my vibe. I love y'all, each and every one of y'all. And we got a big, bold vision to you all. Oh, gosh, we're bringing it to life. And this is heaven sent. I told you, remember, Genius Lynch? Look, this was heaven sent. 
So what more can you want? I mean, huh, you're seeing the true you. You're. Do you know how special you all are? There's people at links their lineage back to that. Do you know how special you are? You're so special that people wants to kill you. They are. I, I'm telling you the truth. We're so special. People wants to take us out. All right, could y'all please hang on? I got to go check my pizza real fast. 10 2 2, 10 22. I just saw. Wait just a second. Okay, I'm back. Bella, you better move. My big bulldog. Down there in a way. You better move. You better move, big bulldog. So anyways, the shock of the new you is is it's 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 overwhelming to people because you had faith in this whole process and you changed for the better and and, and you took a, a chance on yourself with that step and the word wants to be written and you're doing it Aquarius and you're receiving downloads and visions and love opening your heart you're, you and you need to do this collaborative dreaming with others and what do you feel sacred fool you know tell about your visions of life beyond death because you're healing and you're you're restoring and replenishing yourself and you're doing this with force and you've, you've received Pandora's gift and you're defending to the end the worthwhile that you feel is worthy. And you reinvented yourself during Mercury Retrograde and you got a big, bold vision. And this is heaven sent. And you're seeing the true you. Woo, we are. And I love you and I thank you all. And I appreciate you all. Did you know it? And um, let's see. Let me do this. Hang on, you guys. Hang on, you guys and gals, you guys. I'm not doing a tarot reading for you, Aquarius. I'm just doing these little messages, okay? Okay, so we're going to do one of these little messages and see what pops out. What does Aquarius need to know today, Spirit? Please and thank you. We love you. Oh, there's somebody in their thoughts. This man, he can't get you off his mind. He loves you big. And his birthday might be on the 16th, Aquarius. I don't know. Or the 14th, but you're getting a message of concern. He's he's thinking about coming and talking to you. He Yeah, and he might write you a letter and put it in the mailbox or something. I don't know, but he, oh, he's scared he's going to go to jail. Oh, he's did something to you, Aquarius. What is it? Oh, he's scared he's going to be imprisoned if he comes to try to court you. I don't get it, but maybe he thinks you're in prison in your house. That's what, that's what it is. If you got somebody, he thinks you're in prison in your house, I guess, at the moment. Uh, but this courtship is making him feel despair. Like, he thinks he's not ever going to be able to court you. That's what it is. Some of these masculines won't ever even talk to you. How are you supposed to know what they think? You can't. So they gotta learn that. I, I know one thing. I know how to talk, but they don't know how. But oh, and and he's having to do a lot of toil and labor at the moment. <coughs> That's why he's in despair. He don't have enough time to talk to you. What it is? He's working himself to death, and it you know in in the distant horizon, toil and labor in the distant horizon. To this community. This community of two people that was against you all, I guess, Aquarius. What else? Oh, they some false person in a community, man or woman. That's somebody who lies and deceives. Trickery, trickery, doc. Oh, pathway. False what? This false person has a pathway to choose. Oh. What she choosing? What she choosing? 
Oh, and they, they, she got a pathway. And down here, Sudden Wealth, this is another story. Down here, Sudden Wealth. Sudden Wealth is coming to you and your occupation. Woo, thank you. We'll take that, us Aquarius as well. We love you and we thank you. Oh, and we're going to be privileged ladies out there. 1515, us Aquarius ones. Did you see that? Who loves us big? Who loves us big spirit? Oh, the main male loves you, privileged lady. What's main male want to give, privileged lady? What's he want to give, privileged lady? Expectation. Main male expects you to love him, privileged lady. What else does main male want to give us? He wants to take you to the courthouse of Mary. <laughs> You want some Mari at the courthouse? Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, with this official person. He wants to take you to courthouse with this official person and this wealthy man. Maybe you got a lawsuit going on, Aquarius, with a wealthy man and, and uh, this main male and an official person or this official person and wealthy man is on their ass to court. In, that's what it's saying, okay? All right, so now let me get you another one of these little messages of mine. And it could be in the family. All right, Aquarius, it could be in your family. All I know. Trying to get us some messages. Hang on. I'm getting us some messages. Okay, Aquarius. We're free birds, ain't we, Aquarius? Yeah, yeah, that's what we that's what we are. We are free bird, yeah. Fly high. Oh, free bird, yeah. Alright, so now let's see what Spirit says. And some of these are gonna come up upside down, but I can't help it. Spirit, can you give us some answers to give Aquarius? Who, what about thoughts? This man is just embarrassed of you because he's scared about all the stupid shit that he's done to you over the years. So this might be somebody that you're married with or been with for many, many years, okay? And that's why he's in his thoughts because he's treated you like shit. What about message of concern? He's scared that uh, he's he's going to get a message that he's going to go to jail. That's what it is because he didn't let you court this person and he's in despair about it. But it's telling you to protect yourself with prayers because people want to take what you have built. That's a message I'm telling you all. Protect yourself with prayers. What about imprisonment? So he creeps in the woods behind your house. He's going to jail. Okay, don't worry. Ain't that funny how spirit does them? Oh. Oh, how about courtship? Courtship, love, spirit. Courtship, love. It says, two of them come out, and it says, uh, they ain't never saw how high-vibing beings work, and you can't place bets on a divine being because you will lose every time because divine beings win. Yeah, we're going to win in this courtship. See? Yeah. We're winning in it. Don't worry. And... And whoever's in despair, what's it? What about in despair? What about despair, man? Uh, this person is very jealous of you, and they tell way too many lies on you. And God has saw them acting out of character and lying on his child, and this is called a fake ass friend. Okay, that's who's in despair—a fake, a friend of me of yours. And what about toil and labor? I seen somebody I used to work with the other day at the Dama DMV, and he said, hey, what are you doing? I'm getting tags like everybody else. Duh, 1919. And he knew I didn't want to talk to him. But anyway, this man or woman is too complacent, and they need to stop listening to whoever this is that has control over them. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. Start saying yes to them. Somebody you work with. Okay. And what about Distant Horizon? You can't people please everybody. I've learned that, y'all. Please trust me on this. You can't do that. In a Distant Horizon, one of your old BFFs 
could a uh, BFF could be involved in some certain situation, but they could just you could just be seeing an old friend. And what about community? What's gonna happen to community? What's gonna happen to community? Hang on, it didn't come out. What will happen to community? Brain frog, brain frog, brain frog. They casting confusion and losing spells on us. The people in the community, we know that. And who's a false person, spirit? Who the false person? What she says. False person. Uh, when you set boundaries with your partner and they keep on crossing the line you draw, maybe you should rethink this partnership. So somebody out there, you're all connected to a chorus, they're false and they keep crossing your line and and all this person wants to do is fight and act crazy and they're scared of being on their own, so they keep holding on dearly. Yeah, that's what it is. And what about pathway? They were all paid to put you down, but you're on top. They was trying to stop you from your pathway. That's what it was. And what about sudden wealth? Who getting sunny wealth? Oh, you're cosmically aligned with your life purpose. And it's a wonderful thing, honey. I like this one. It's for me and you, Aquarius. And we're getting sudden wealth. <laughs> God loves us, see? And what about occupation? You, you need to keep your vibe high if you want to be with your divine masculine or divine feminine, okay? Maybe you're all going to work together like doing this. Like, I think that would be great. What about privileged lady? You're an empath and you can feel everyone's energy. And you have to remember how you were treated by the narcissist in your life. And all the lies that they said, okay? You got to remember that privileged lady. And, and main male, you have to take control of how you respond to people in harsh situations and talk in a cool, calm, and collected type of way. And, and don't be like, get out of here. You need to respond like, yes, sir, I'm getting my stuff gathered up and going to leave. Okay, if they're being an asshole, say, I'm going to leave. <laughs> like that, plain and simple. And expecting what? Yeah, uh, someone needs to get out of a controlling situation uh, of a con of a contractual agreement that is need to be broken because it is toxic and not meant to stay. But so somebody's expecting a, a divorce or out of a contract at work or something, or somebody could have got some life insurance money on you and you didn't know it. What about courthouse? What about courthouse? Courthouse. You, you might have to, what you feel, you're going to have to speak on it. But you know how to make people see two sides of the story, so you might have to talk about it in court with this official person. What official person need to say today? What's official person need to say today? He is a damn vamp that does mirror magic on you. they got to feed to survive, okay? So whoever this official man is in the courts, that's what they are. What about wealthy man? What wealthy man said? Wealthy man is a past life relationship, and you have known each other before. That's what it says, Aquarius. Okay, that's what it's saying. Let me get these little cards. Do we have another message? I hope y'all like how I do this and hit subscribe. It's greatly appreciated because I'm trying to help us all. <laughs> and you need to look in your mid heaven and your birth chart. And that's the 10th house and see what's in your house, okay? And this is where influences and status in your job and career in your community, it'll tell you how you need to fix yourself or it'll show you, okay? And you're connected to your animals and they are, are aware of every time you are upset because they will come to your side when you're upset and you're in tune with nature and animals. Wow! That's great. And you're in tune with nature and you know that somebody is creeping around your house if you're like me because we're divine beings. What else about divine beings? And we're wonderful and they never saw how good we work. <laughs> They're seeing a psychopath towards us and somebody put false police reports on us too. Somebody did. On us divine beings and 
And all because we're bringing awareness to the way a human brain works on the inside. We even tell how our brain works. Okay? What else? Excuse me. It says, be a service to those who are weak and transitioning into the afterlife. So maybe you're someone that is a nurse or something in a hospice. And I love y'all if you are. And I, I, I commend you out there. <clears throat> but, you know, you're going through a positive change at the moment. Because hermit card come out and you chose yourself over others and i don't know why that card's in there because that goes in my deck that i made my deck that's my angels i don't know where my deck is but uh this dude wants to ride on your coattails because he ain't got no damn gumption this person that done brain fog and somebody just wanted you to chase them all over the damn town but when you saw them they run from you because they didn't ever know what true love was. That's why. That's why they run. They're scared of that. And they was in lust. Honey, lust is not love. You got to learn the difference between lust and love. They didn't know the difference, you see. What about cosmically aligned or life purpose? Sudden wealth. Somebody wants to go fishing with us. Maybe you get downloads by water. Keep your vibe high. Listen to music. That's how you keep your vibe high, okay? And somebody says, why don't you want me, Aquarius? Why? Why don't you want me? They only want opportunity to bang you, Aquarius, whoever it is. And and we've got positive energy over here and no negative energy. That's another reason. And you need to connect to your higher selves and do what is right for you and the good of all involved, okay? And... Some woman feels trapped in a loveless relationship out there, okay? And you could be a spiritual shaman that might be feeling like that. And you can cleanse excess ne negative energy, which is said to confuse or pollute your soul. And they don't belong to a religion. You, it's just spiritual practice. And we see your true colors, past life, past life relationships shining through. We see your true colors. All this rejection was for your protection. Angels got you wrapped up in their arms. Yes, we know that. Thank you, angels. We love you. We thank you muchly so. We thank you so. And little frog said, you're going through a total metamorphosis at this time. Okay? And, you know, this person will call you every name in the book. But and curse you out, but they can't say that you're a child of God. They just spew hate at you. Yeah, yeah. And when you do the work on the inside internally, it shows up externally. You know it? Yeah, it does. Oh, I gotta hurry up. It's on 28. And Divine Masculine is very action oriented. He's focused on doing rather than just being. He's coming to you, Divine Masculine is Aquarius. And. But he has trust issues that stems back from his old girlfriends. And now they're trying to pack him over into the relationship with you, Aquarius. And no, don't because they need to heal their insides on the first, on the inside of them, sir. So trust me, okay? Trust me that you can't get in a relationship until after you did that. And then it'll flourish and thrive always. All right. Well, I love you all and I appreciate you and... This, above all, to refuse to be a victim. Remember that, okay? And, and, and to a daybreak that's wondrously clear, I rise, Maya Angelo. And that was by Margaret Atwood. This, above all, to refuse to be a victim. Don't be a victim to the circumstance. You choose to rise above that and be a leader, okay? Okay, Aquarius, and please hit subscribe, and I love y'all, and I'll see you back here in a little bit. Peace.